Me and Grim are gonna give you a tour of my princess room. Princess room for 40 something year olds. Okay, let's start. My princess room is a work in progress and it is kind of weird that I have it like this, but hey, I got these beautiful, beautiful wall hangings off the next door neighbor for $25. Couldn't believe it. They were made for someone. They didn't want them. Then I got this bed that is gorgeous. Um, there was a really expensive one that was different. This was a cheaper one, but I got this on next door neighbor for really, I think like $60, something ridiculously low. Those are curly willows I put on top to add to the princess effect. Okay, these are some, oh, this should be on. See, I have these little lights on my dolls. They might not go on because um, I have it, I have it for nighttime and that um, lights them up. There's uh, some of my bigger girls. And there's a nook next to my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful Celia. Cecilia, there's that girl. Okay, and then this is where it gets problematic. All right, I just move things around. I change things. Now, yes, that's a doll chateau. And those are recast for Poppy. Now, before you judge me, this is a doll I would never be able to get. I know it's wrong to get it, but I got this one from this lady in Spain, Sonia something, she the, the something sad princess. And she does beautiful work and I love them. It's the only way I would ever have one. They're just, I mean, her work is really pretty and I don't know. So this is this gonna turn on? It's too light. I have all sorts of beautiful girls here. I changed their wigs and stuff. Been moving this, this was on the other side. I think it works better here. Here's my beautiful mermaid that my three-year-old niece can't get enough of. That's why her wings are off. I got this doll for a steal, really because someone had paid for half of her and then didn't want to pay for the rest. So I have, she has like three different kinds of ears, two different arms, she has wings, she has gills, she has everything. I found this, this very cute um, thing on the on garbage day. I took it and this is a recast. Why did I get a recast? Well, there is a reason why. This is a coral reef doll that they no longer make. So. I don't feel as bad getting a doll that they don't make anymore because the company isn't missing out on the money. Yes, it's wrong, but I wanted to see what the recasts were really like. I do have the Papavi ones, but that was by a really professional person. And honestly, I think she's just the cutest. Very happy with how she turned out in my clothes. And then these are some, um, this is a Forever Hearts. And this is a Forever Hearts. They're very breakable. I asked my cat who broke both of them. This is a Tyler, what, what is it? Faith, Faith Tilbrook doll. And she's wearing a jean outfit. She's really gorgeous. Little guys, little, that I paid for. <laughs> okay, so then I have my other girls, my big girls. And I uh, have my doll zone, my doll more. I love this boy. I cannot get enough of this boy. He is old, he is old, but he just stays. The tan stays. This is the one I showed you, but this one. Oh my God, how charming is that face up? I'll do more on her later. She, I bought her, first I bought, oh my God, I forgot her name right now. And then I got her, the Agatha and something. And uh, she didn't come with a full set. But she was, she's a real doll, Chateau doll. This is a pigeon doll. And I wanted her to wear something else except for her bad girl clothes. She's like a bad, bad girl, little black dress. And I was like, how can I make her look good in this purple outfit? I took a really big pink uh, wig and, and put it over. And I mean, it looks great, I think, but I don't know. This is my other little doll. I was gonna get rid of the little dolls, but then I got all new clothes from Temu. And it, it, seriously, like, it changed them. There's more girls, more girls, more girls. Ugh, love that girl. These are the ones my niece likes the most. And it's great because this is an inexpensive doll. Well, it's, uh, um, it's Ellen Wild. And there's Mia looking great. She's so cool, she's such a cool doll. And my first real, oh, here's the church doll. I got this at the church thing. He, he looks like Christopher Walken as his girlfriend, Barbie. <laughs> and then my weasel. I almost got another weasel, but 
I can't spend $170 on a new weasel. This weasel's gonna have to do. And no, she did not come with the sunglasses and the hoe. I put that in there. So yeah, I'm Catholic. I have rosemary feet that you don't wear them. You're supposed to pray with them. And uh, yeah, so this is my princess room. I hope you liked it. It's a lot of dolls and I have a big announcement. I borrowed a ton of money because I am getting a sleepy eyed, like awakening eye, clover, doll fi um, icon doll. It's a few years old. Now, I could have got a new one that was with the white skin and the red hair, but it didn't have a sleepy eye. And I found this one, it was in France, and I bought it. I borrowed money to buy it. And I have to say, I, I can't wait. French mail is kind of slow. But, you know, that's all right. I'm, I don't even know where I'm going to put her. So what you going to do? What you going to do? Beautiful dolls all around. It might be weird to have all these dolls, but, you know, they represent, each one represents place in my life. I started collecting when I was 30. I'm now in my 40s. Uh, I'm, I'm pretty old. Uh, I'm 47. And I have, like, all these dolls. And they each one, they were very expensive, but each one is a, piece of the time of my life. I have ones that I got when I was young. I got ones when I was older. And honestly, they're all in beautiful shape because I keep them in dark rooms. And I, I don't know how the, the, um, the lady from the, God, why can't I remember her name ever? I, I don't know how she keeps her dolls clean because she has that room of dolls, like that super room of dolls. She says she vacuums. I live by a highway. I think that's how it gets in here. Now I'm telling you, it's dirty doll time all the time. Always with paintbrushes and stuff trying to clean them. You know, you have to get right stands too. I love the black and the rod iron. There's my <laughs> slippers. But you know, it's it's my room and it's fun. I was sick for a really long time. I had no chance of going anywhere. And this was my entertainment and now I'm better. I'm gonna be going places and Soon I'll be getting that icon doll and I'll be showing it to all of you. So have a great night, great Friday night. Hope you're spending it with your dolls because the doll life is the best life. Who are we going to end on? Maybe this beautiful girl, oh, glowing eyes, or this wig that I just transformed. <laughs> well, next time I'll show you what it looked like before it was falling apart. So I had to do something. It's very, very, uh, Emma Nicole Smith. <laughs> have a great night.